What's up, YT? We back in the trap, man. Back here in St. Louis. First day getting back to it. I've been back about uh, almost a little over a week. Let's get on the, let's get on the. We finna start it over from scratch like we always do. Right about now. I'm waiting on young Chad to get to the office. <clears throat> so we can get out here and do some cable TV, man. Let's get a check coming in. It's been a while since we didn't did that, so that's where we at with it. But I got this old broken reel right here with some good six and a quarter on it. It's not damaged where it's broken at. And it's got about 500 feet on it. So that's enough to get us started for the day. Just test out my corn tools, make sure everything cutting properly. Make sure I can do my splicing. I need a, uh, I think I pretty much got everything. But you know you always forget something, right? Everybody know that you're gonna forget something. Unless you're perfect. I don't think nobody did. Cause it's past nine o'clock and look who just showed up. Ain't cool with it. <laughs> All right, so we have the second job of the day. This one actually we're gonna put up cable. We got two spans, a six and a quarter, three pole transfers, and I'm gonna splice off a of LE to two taps. I don't know why they don't rep wanna replace the end of the line, but that's on them. Let's get to it. Strapped up, ready to do it again. This one a little more detail oriented than the last one. I get spliced, I ain't spliced in months. I need a rope. What you talking about? I'm just trying to be, become a better vlogger, that's all. I get there eventually. I need my uh, drill. Pole strap, chain hoist, I'm gonna get this up as high as I can get it. That's what real linemen do. We don't just put it back on the pole. We get it up there, you know? Within safety, uh, within violation, at least. And within what our drops will let us do. But that's where we are, and that's where I'm going. Trying to be straight on and square as possible. I turn my boat because I'm ate up like that. Bling blah. What does your transfer look like?
putting the last minute touches on the uh, transfer. Got the equipment out the pole. We up higher. Yes, sir. Hand bent loop. About to work on this real quick, get it prepped up. On cold splice, we're gonna come back and stab it. Like I said in the beginning, I always forget something. Got out here about to start splicing. Ain't got my torch, man. Ain't got my torch, man. So now I gotta make a call to the house, see if my old lady bring my torch so I can splice this in. I mean, I got more work out here to do. I guess I could just put on my fittings and everything, cut it over and come back climb the pole again. I ain't trying to do all that. Oh, I didn't mention, I didn't have no six and a quarter fittings either. <laughs> Ah, uh, first day back though, man. You gotta know this type of stuff gonna happen. Look for my glove now so I can get back to work. I got another car right here. So I'm just gonna keep it. Anybody else end up with all one hand gloves? Cause you just, I'm right handed. So I naturally got all left gloves. Like right now my right hand ain't got no glove, my left do. I've got, hung, I've got tons of left gloves. And no rights, man. Crazy. 